I decided to pick up a new hobby recently because I wanted to do something while I'm with my cats. Obviously, I can't do all my essential oil stuff while they're around and I'm with them like most of the time. I decided to learn how to make your own stamps. So today, let me walk you through how I make them. This is just an intro video as I plan to have my workshop on DIY stamp making by January and I will be uploading online classes by next year. I have a lot of tools scattered on my table. I'll upload another video detailing all the tools that I need and some tips for beginners. But for now, let me just show you a short demo clip on how I make this Santa cat stamp. Alright, so while we're at it, let me just show you how to quickly change the nibs of your speedball cutter. As you can see, I use a variety of tools in different sizes. Sometimes they come from different sets, but you'll need all those tools when doing your DIY stamp carving.
Okay, so as you can see, I'm done carving my Santa Cat stamp. It's time to make an impression or, you know, just put a little ink just to see how it will print on paper. Now, I love using this blank paged notebook. I won this in my digital marketing class years ago. So, I use this notebook to put all my impressions. And from here, you can see that if you need to remove bits and pieces on the sides if it looks distracting or you want to get that you know artistic take you want that small pieces of carved lines on your impression it depends on you but i like going for like a cleaner look and yeah so i guess that's all for today here are some of the stamps that i've already created I wanted to do like a stamp a day thing and um, if this interests you don't forget to leave me a comment and if you want to join my workshop next year I'd love to see you in the class so I guess there you go guys that's all for today's video I hope you've enjoyed it and I guess I'll see you in my next one bye